parents, friends, faculty, administration, platform guests, members of the Board of Trustees, Dr. Tall, and members of the class of 2011. Sitting behind me, I would like to introduce the Worcester Preparatory School class of 2011. We are 39 students strong. Do not be deceived by our small number. We are not just a class, we are a family. Together we have learned, together we have laughed, together we have cried, and together we have grown. During our years of Worcester, we have seen many changes. The construction of a new gym, a new library, a new wing, the use of iPads and computers, and a name change. From Worcester Country School to Worcester Preparatory School. I believe the name change was appropriate, realizing that all 39 of us are leaving here today with something far greater than an outstanding education. Any institution can teach. Worcester prepares. Our expectation is not just subject learning. We were groomed to be citizens for the future. Our grooming started off in second grade when we participated in the manners banquet. We were taught proper table manners, how to greet people, and many different types of etiquette. Today, some of us may not remember which utensil we used first, but we do know how to act with integrity and respect. We also understand that appearance is very important. Thanks to members of the faculty and administration, we know never to have our shirts untucked, to always have a belt, and that white socks do not match with dress shoes. We have now started to create our own legacy of proper conduct. Last spring, members of our class helped develop the first Worcester Preparatory School Honor Code. The Honor Code will serve as a moral compass for all students. We are proud to have been part of the implementation. When I think of compassion in terms of our class, the golden rule comes to mind. Do to others what you have had them, have them do to you. Throughout our upper school career, we have participated in numerous volunteer activities that were both memorable and rewarding. In events such as the Christmas food drive, the Relay for Life, and the beach cleanup, there was no hesitation to lend a helping hand. This year, a few of our classmates helped create the first school blood drive. We are very proud of them. Not only does this class care for our community, but also each other. An exchange student from China entered our class in our junior year. On the first day of school, I could tell he felt nervous about attending high school 7,000 miles away from home. At the end of his first day, when I asked him how he felt, he said, I felt like I have just been adopted into a new family. We welcomed him with open arms and gave him our hearts. This kind of warmth and love that we share with each other is truly special. No matter where our lives take us, I know we'll always be there for each other. Outstanding leadership, academically and athletically, is abundant in our class. In the classroom, we lead by example, striving to achieve our best. Some of our classmates have achieved the highest academic awards and serve as excellent role models for all of us. On the sports field, we've developed leadership skills that we will carry throughout our lives. Our fifth and eighth grade trips to Echo Hill also played an important role in our development. We endured the outdoors for three days as we learned about the environment and played games that built our teamwork. During meals, we were convinced to clear our plates because our wasted food would be put into the slop bucket, that funky bucket. <laughs> this taught our 10 and 13 year old selves that waste was harmful. We've been exposed to many different cultures. Our class trips to France, Spain, and England help us realize that today, we are a global community, and that we must grow with the rest of the world. These trips allowed us to stop, look around, and bond as a class. We may be moving on in 39 different directions, but we will always be bound by the principles we have learned at Worcester. We want to thank each and every one of you for your support. You have made a difference in our lives, and we will never forget the valuable lessons you've instilled in us. Faculty, who have in 
influence us each in your own special way. You have made us who we are. Miss Farrow, thank you for believing in us. You have been a great teacher, a great mentor, and a great class sponsor. You have helped us create so many memories that we will always cherish. We truly appreciate all your thought for us. Parents, we are so grateful for all your thought for us. We love you. <clears throat> when you drop us off at school next year, do not be sad. Rest assured, we are well prepared for college, but we are also Worcester prepared for life. Class of 2011, let's buckle up. It's going to be a wonderful ride. Thank you.